Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast, the ceremony of commemoration of the victims of genocide of Armenians will be held in Mondeli La Napu. Monuments of Leonid Asgardian in Yervas was vandalized. Statement of the National Assembly of Republic of Artsakh. An Armenian school was vandalized in Kastat Napol. The United States is ready to help establish peace between Armenia and Azerbaijan, U.S. State Department. Apricot frost in Malatya, Western Armenia. The damage is huge. Pages from the history of Armenia. Chairman of the National Council of Western Armenia, Armina Kabramian, the Armenian Union of Mandeli La Napu, the Assembly of Armenian Veterans of Western Armenia, the Association of French Resistance Fighters of Armenian Origin, invite you to take part in a commemoration ceremony of the victims of genocide committed against the Armenian people. The ceremony will take place on Mandeli La Napu on Monday, April 25, 2022. At 11 a.m. under the chairmanship of Mayor Sebastian Lore, address Armenia Square 06210 Mandelila Napu, Armenia Square, in front of Khachkar. The ceremony will be held according to the protocol. After the destruction of the monuments to Leonid and Manuk on the top of Mount Aragats, criminals now want to demolish the monument to Leonid Asganzian in Yerevan. Beside the statue, these criminals want to destroy the spirit that lived and the origin of liberation of Artsakh. For about 25 years, the policy of destroying the symbols of our resistance have been carried out throughout Armenia and Artsakh. It all started with the collapse of the Shushi Regiment of the Special Purpose Detachment. Today's action reminds me of the destruction of Khachkars by the Azerbaijan army in the Juha Cemetery. These criminals are now freely walking around Yerevan. The cameras could not capture this scene. Who is the blame for this situation? April 15, 2022, Armena Kabramian. A monument to Leonid Asgadian was desecrated in Yerevan. A criminal case has been initiated. As a result of the operational measures carried out by the police, the identity of the criminal has been established. As a result of the operational search measures taken, the investigators of the Central Police Department identify the perpetrator of the AG. A 55-year-old man, a resident of Mashtots Avenue in Yerevan, was taken to the Central Police Station and confessed he was arrested. The current legal and political status of Republic of Artsakh has been formed through the expression of the will of the people and through referendums adopted by the constitution based on their results and a nationwide consensus reached among the Armenians in previous years. The Armenians of Artsakh are well aware of the peace of price, the status of Artsakh, their right to live freely and independently in its historical homeland and absolute values, and even the threat of war cannot force us to renounce them. Any negotiation process between Armenia and Azerbaijan is it a peace agenda which presupposes the forcible incorporation of Artsakh into Azerbaijan, as well as the signing of document resulting from it undermines not only the statehood of Artsakh, but also violates the rights of the Armenians of Artsakh to live in their historical homeland. Read the full statement on our official website. The Armenian school of Kastad Napol have been vandalized, the persecution reports, an act of vandalism shortly before the preparation of April 17 for Easter and April 24 for the anniversary of the genocide of Armenian people. We want to remind you that the same school was subjected to anti-Armenian attack in November 2016 when the inscription one night we will suddenly find ourselves in Artsakh appeared on the walls. Also in 2016, the walls of Armenia Seminary were dedicated with anti-Armenian graffiti. The inscriptions long live the Turkish race and torture to Armenians were left on the world. The press secretary of the U.S. State Department, Ned Rees, answering a question from one of the journalists, said at a briefing, We continue to remain loyal to the peace in the South Caucasian region, democratic and purpose future in the South Caucasian region, and as you know from Secretary Blinker's messages, we welcome the meeting of Armenian Prime Minister Pashinyan and Azerbaijan President Aliyev on April 6 in Brussels, including positive progress in preparing peace talks and the establishment of bilateral commission on delimitation, including in the role of co-chair of the OAC MIS group to help countries achieve a long-term and comprehensive peace, the State Department representative said. In response to this statement, President of Western Armenia Armina Abrahamian asks Ned Price to take into account Mr. Joseph Biden's recognition of the genocide of Armenian people, which also includes the pogroms carried out by the Azerbaijan authorities in Shushi in 1920. 
In the Malatya province of Western Armenia, the air temperature dropped to minus 5 to 6 degrees, which led to frosty by the apricot trees. Frost destroyed the apricot crop, which is considered a source of lighthood for the villagers. In recent days, low air temperature have hit agriculture in many regions. We want to remind you that Malatya is the province that produced the most apricots in Western Armenia. Many call it as the birthplace of apricots. Armenia is one of the oldest civilizations of the world, with a history of more than 10,000 years and its people are a native of Armenian highlands, which is located in western Armenia. Based on numerous archaeological finds, ancient inscriptions and scientific research, the Armenian highlands are the cradle of civilizations. The Artsakh region, like Nehijevan, are part of historical Armenia. The name Armenian Artsakh, some sources indicate, comes from the word Tsakh, which in the ancient Armenian language means forest, since there are many thickest of forest in Artsakh. The word Nahijevan in Armenian means the place of descent, referring to the descent of Noah's Ark from the adjacent Mount Ararat. Now musical part Armenian folk song of Hayots Kajer Vartan Aramian. <laughs> The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.